my kitchen, cleaning out my fridge. I'm going to be wiping it down, organizing it, and getting a system to how I like it. So stay tuned so you can be motivated to clean your fridge too. So this is currently how it looks. Um, it's a little more bare right now, so I thought it would be a perfect day to do a good old clean out and a reorganize. So, on the top is where I normally do my milk and just whatever else is up there. Um, yeah, it's just not a whole lot of organization going on, especially this drawer and the doors. completely empty there it is with lots of little crummies in there I'm sure you can see that oh I forgot something but look at that Ooh, gross especially my vegetable and fruit bin those need a good old wiping okay and here's everything out of my fridge as you noticed uh, we do have quite a few condiments my husband <laughs> really enjoys condiments I do too as well but um some things like you probably pull saw me pull these out these are scobies for kombucha they look nasty but i will keep that and some of these things like this is from a summer vacation and why i saved them who knows but they're gonna go in the garbage and um i was gonna spiralize these broccoli stems and they are now moldy so no little things like that you gotta get rid of all right so here's a little tip if it does have an expiration date this is 11, 16, 16. You should probably get rid of it if it is over a year old. I like to prep my own food, so I'll have to find um, a way to keep it organized and probably put some labels and such on my drawers as well. All right, to wipe down the fridge, I'm going to use this Mrs. Meyers all-purpose cleaner and my kitchen Norwex rag. So great combo, let's get going. taking the drawers out and washing them and just getting underneath of there because that is so gross under there you probably can't see it so wash those drawers my final fridge product so on the top shelf I have my drinks and I ended up writing with an expo marker I don't know if you can see this um, dairy and juice right on there on the glass because it just wipes off um, so I have well my juices and dairy then here right here it says leftovers and this is perfect because then my hubby knows exactly where to grab the leftovers at. And I really love these Pyrex or Anchor glass bowls. I use these all the time because they're reheatable on the stovetop even. Um, all right, then here I have snacks like chopped veggies and protein bars, stuff like that. Then down here I have what I said, bread and eggs. Um, this one I did not label because you can kind of see it's like our deli meats and cheeses and avocados and I like these Dollar Tree baskets these are like two years old I think from the Dollar Tree all right then this one is my fruit and there you can see I wrote on there eh, kind of hard to see 
Again, I used Dollar Tree baskets and a tip. Find some baskets you already have around your house. So I already had this CD case. All right, then my vegetables. I wrote veggies on here. Anyway, that is that. Then down here I have kind of the homemade things. And here, it's so hard to see, I'm sorry. Spreads, um, so like jelly, mayonnaise, stuff like that. Here, condiments, like all the condiments we love. If you remember saying my hubby and I really like condiments, so perfect, there's my doggy. Um, and then up here, we just have my, like, some pills that have to be refrigerated, a deodorizer, but I like having these. These were like 80 cents at Walmart, so really cheap. And these are my scobies, like I said, for kombucha. And then I have butter in here, right there. And it's so much cleaner, and I just like it organized, and it just makes me feel happy inside to know I can see everything in there. So I hope this was helpful and you can find some motivation and tips in this video as well. Thanks so much for watching this deep clean of my fridge. Definitely give it a thumbs up if you enjoy organizing and cleaning because it is a new year and that is what a lot of people like to do, including myself. So if you want to see more of these type of videos, I'd love to have you subscribe and join my YouTube family. And also hit that bell notification so you know every time I post a new video. Alright, hope you have a blessed and wonderful day. Bye.